Hey everyone, Steve James here, and we are going to be talking about how to set up the new Facebook pixel on your website. In this tutorial, you'll be able to set up your pixel in just two steps. The first step is to create your pixel in Business Manager. So we're going to want to go to Business Manager, and we're going to want to go to the home page. We're going to then want to click your ad account, and then we're going to want to go to Tools and Pixels. Here you can see the default screen that shows how to set this up. So basically we're going to want to click this green button. This gives us the ability to name the pixel, so that I would just suggest putting something in there that represents your business. You're going to want to make sure you agree to the Facebook pixel terms. You can click on this to read more. And then you're going to click create pixel. You can now install it by clicking this button or emailing this pixel code to your web developer. If you click install pixel now, it brings up this pop-up screen. And here you can just basically copy the code. Once you hit next, it's going to take you into some next steps and we will go into these into part two of our video series and we'll go into tracking custom conversions and creating custom audiences later. I'm going to hit done. It's going to let you know that you're all set. You can also go to this tab and go back to Actions and View Pixel Code or Edit Pixel Code or email it again. So here if I went to View Pixel Code, it's going to bring up that same screen. I can copy the code, hit Done. And then I'm going to go on to the second step, which is basically adding the pixel to your website pages. So what we're going to do is we're going to go over to our lead page and I'm going to show you how we can add it to our lead page account. So I'm going to go here, go to lead page options, go to tracking codes, and paste the code in the head tag tracking code section. And then I can hit done and save. I'm also going to show you how to do this in another content management system. So this is our HubSpot CMS and I can go here to our page which is just a landing page, I can go to settings. And here I'm going to go to add head HTML code. This is also where you would possibly integrate Google Analytics. Hit paste. Hit save. In this case I'm going to update that page so it's live. And then I'm going to view it. So on this landing page we can then utilize a plugin, a Chrome plugin called Facebook Pixel Helper. You can find it just by Googling Facebook Pixel Helper. It's also in the developers.facebook uh, site where you can go and download that as a Chrome plugin. I'll post this link below. And that Pixel Helper helps you understand what pixels are working, if they're working correctly, or if they're not, and maybe there's a loading issue. And you can work with your developer to find out. You can click the Learn More to find out what's going on. But if you actually click in here and you look at Facebook Pixel loaded successfully, it then actually gives you the Pixel ID. And you can compare that with your Pixel ID that was originally in Business Manager and make sure that that is set up correctly. In the next video, I'll show you two other steps to help track conversions and optimize your ads with standard events and custom conversions.